Here we're going to talk about composite figures. Okay, so let's start by identifying what is the shape of this object or this house. Anong shape ng house na to? Do we have a name of a shape for this kind of object? Wala. But as we can see, we can find some basic shapes within it. Can we see a triangle? Yes, there are triangles. Uh, is there square? Yes, there is. Rectangle? Meron ba rectangle? Yung mga pintana at pinto. Meron bang circle? Yun, yung pintana sa taas. Uh, meron bang trapezoid? Uh, ito yung trapezoid. Okay. So next, let's identify the shape of the following objects. Here we have a clock and its shape is circle. We have a watermelon. Shape is triangle. Biscuit, square. Uh, envelope, rectangle. A bag, trapezoid. But how about this thing? Anong tao? Anong object? Anong shape niya? Well, we do not have a certain name of shape to represent this kind of object, but it falls under the category of composite figure. What is composite figure exactly? Composite figure, a figure made up of basic shapes such as triangle, rectangle, circle, uh, square, and trapezoid. And as you can see, this example here is actually a combination of triangle and a square. Diba? So that's a composite figure. Another example, tignan maige. Here. So we have some example of composite figure here. And as you can see, all of them is a combination of at least two objects or two shapes, two basic shapes. See? Itong mga shapes na to. And question, how to find the area of a composite figure? So, now that we know that the composite figure is just a composition of basic shapes, question, how to find the area? Mm -hmm. So, to answer that, kailangan natin hanapin yung area ng mga basic shapes na to, then add or subtract them, whichever the case is. So, ito. If you were asked to find the area of this, you need to find the area of the rectangle plus the area of the square. Same thing applies with all of this. As okay. So, kailangan natin malaman lahat ng formula nila. Kailangan natin ma-review lahat ng formula. Okay. Here, we have a uh, match the figure to its cor corresponding formula. Ano ba yung mga formula ng mga fa to find the area of this figure? Uh, itong circle, ito yun. Tama? Pi r squared. Yung square natin, ito. S squared. Side squared. Yung rectangle natin, ah. Yes, rectangle. Ano no? Triangle natin, ito. Base times height over 2. Yung rectangle natin is length times width, and then yung trapezoid natin, ayan ito. Okay. So, ganyan siya. Okay. So, let's apply this formula and try to solve this figure that has been shown. Uh, we have this composite figure, and first, we need to dissect it. Kailangan malaman natin ano ba yung basic shape that it composed to. Ito meron tayong square and a rectangle. Okay. So, as we can see, 5 to. 5 to nasa taas. Eh, how about this? Ito yung size na yan. So, alam natin, this is 10. Yung isang buo na yan. This is 5. So, kung 5 to, then yung total, anong dapat to? 5. Okay, so 5 cm yan. Then we have 12 cm under. Okay. And solve the natin. So, this is 
5 cm centimeter this is 12 centimeter yan lagi sa baba this is 5 by 5 so this is a square and a rectangle so to solve we need to find the area of the rectangle so length times width area 1 is equal to length times width 5 times 12 area 2 is equal to 5 squared ah, so muna natin isa isa 5 times 12 that's 60 so area ba natin is 60 area 2 is 5 squared so 5 times 5 25 so areas area one natin is 60 centimeters squared and this is 25 centimeters squared. and then we need to add them so yung total area is equal to area 1 plus area 2 so 60 plus 25 60 plus 25 is 70 85 85 centimeter squared next one so tatlo to obvious naman we have a rectangle another rectangle and a triangle so kailangan malaman nuna at this is 5 by 6 ito 5 by 6 ito i5 no 15 yung total nito pero yung rectangle na to hanggang ano lang siya hanggang dito lang so hindi natin pwedeng gamitin yung 15 pwede natin gamitin yung Ito, 7, tsaka yung 5. So, 7 plus 5. This is, uh, the total length of this is 5 plus 7, 12. S inches na pala. Tapos, ano yung height niya? The total is 10. Tap, pero nakuha na yung 6 dito. Ilan na lang natira dito sa baba? Man, nakuha na yung 6 dito. Eh. So, 6 na to. Ilan na lang yung natitira dito. So, that's gonna be uh, 4. Tama? 4 inches. So, we have 12 by 4. Tapos, itong triangle natin. Uh, ang total is 15. Nakuha na yung 12 dito. Ilan na lang natitira dito? 12, 13, 14, 15. 3. 3 inches. Then, syempre, 4 inches din itong ano niya. Okay. Solve na natin. At 12, 4. Wait lang. Natandaan ko lang. 3, 4. Ayan. So, 12 to. Tapos, 4. Tapos, ito ay 3, 4. Tapos, ito ay 6, 5. Medyo mahirap. Area 1 natin is equal to 3, Ah, it's triangle. So, ang formula natin is BH times height, base times height over 2. So, 3 times 4 over 2. Area 1 is equal to 3 times 4 is 12 divided by 2, 6 inches squared. Uh, area 2 natin for the rectangle, 12 by 4. So, multiply that 12 times 4. 12 times 4 is 48 inches squared. And then, ito yung area 3 natin. 6 times 5. 6 times 5 is 30 inches squared. And all we have to do is to add them. Just add. Area is equal to 6 plus 48 plus 30. So, 6 plus 48 plus 30 is 84. Okay, ganun lang kadali, 84. Basta i-dissect lang natin yung pri yung shape. Alamin natin ano yung mga basic shape natin composed to. Tapos solve natin isa-isa, add. Another example. Here we have a triangle and a semicircle, parang circle siya, no? So, dissect natin. We have a triangle and this is a full circle. 
Pero yung nakuha natin ay 1 fourth lang. ba diba? Hindi ka lahat eh. 1 fourth lang. Ito lang. Yan lang. Ayan. 1 fourth lang. So, it, this is this will be the radius. And then, this is the length of triangle. So, kung 4 feet to, malamang radius yan. 4 feet din to. Tama. O, review yung radius. Okay? O, dissect natin. So, this is 14. Tapos 4 to. Tapos 4 din to. Compete for the area of the first shape, the tri triangle. 14 times 4 over 2. 14 times 4 over 2. Uh, 14 times 4 is 56. 56 over 2 is 28. So we have 28 square feet. Area 2. Ito pi r squared. What is the value of pi? It's 3.14. Pwede nyong i-type yan. Kung may calculator kayong may pi, just click the pi. 3.14 times 4 squared. So, 3.14 3.14 times 4 squared that is 50.24 But, but, as 1 fourth lang siya ng circle. So, hindi pa tapos. Itong 50.24, kailangan natin yan i-divide by 4. So, yung area 2 natin is di-divide pa natin ng 4. Lagyan ko dito, divide by 4. Okay. Kasi 1 fourth lang siya, ba So, ano lang siya? 12.56. square feet. Then, just add them. A is equal to 28 plus 12.56 and the answer is 40.56. That's it. So, that's it for this video. I hope you learn something from this. Ayan. And thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Goodbye.